Clothing has played a significant role in human history for centuries, although its exact origins are unclear due to the perishable nature of early fabrics. Genetic analysis indicates that humans started wearing clothing around 170,000 years ago. Archaeological findings, such as sewing needles dating back to 40,000 years ago and evidence of dyed fibers from 36,000 BC offer valuable insights into ancient clothing practices. These discoveries shed light on the evolution of clothing and its importance in human culture throughout history. I've managed to collect a remarkable assortment of 14 ancient garments and accessories that have withstood the test of time. In 2015, scientists made an exciting discovery at a Neanderthal site in Croatia. They found eight eagle talons, which turned out to be the world's oldest form of bling. These talons, originating from at least three eagles, had intricate cut marks and were polished with great care. It is believed that they were used as part of a necklace or bracelet. This finding challenges the traditional perception of Neanderthals as primitive beings. Instead, it suggests that they had a complex and intelligent society that engaged in practices like religion and art. The fact that the Talons were chosen for their ceremonial significance indicates that Neanderthals had a sophisticated understanding of symbolism. What's even more fascinating is that the jewelry dates back approximately 80,000 years before the arrival of modern humans. This means that Neanderthals couldn't have borrowed or imitated the design from our ancestors. It highlights their unique creativity and cultural practices. Overall, this discovery sheds new light on the capabilities and cultural sophistication of Neanderthals, challenging our previous assumptions about them. The world's oldest trousers were discovered in the Yanghai Tunes in China in 2014. Despite their age, the trousers are still in good condition. The trousers were likely custom-made by weaving three separate pieces of cloth and sewing them together. The fabric of the trousers features intricate geometric designs. Researchers believe that pants evolved among equestrian tribes in the region around 4,000 years ago. Pants provided both protection and comfort while riding horses. The arid desert conditions in the area have helped preserve delicate textiles and fabrics. Other items found at the site include colorful sheepskin boots, feathered hats, a fringed skirt, and a tiny loincloth. The world's oldest socks, dating back to 250 to 420 AD, were discovered in an ancient Greek colony in central Egypt. These Romano-Egyptian socks are bright red and have a unique split-toe design, leading some to call them alien socks or lobster toes. The split toe was likely intentional to allow the wearer to comfortably wear sandals with the socks. These socks are a rare example of a knitting technique called mill binding, which is a slow technique similar to sewing. They were wear upon from the toe up to the ankle. The Tark hand dress, believed to be the world's oldest known garment, was found in an ancient Egyptian cemetery near Cairo. Dating back to the First Dynasty or Old Kingdom period, the dress is made entirely of linen and showcases skilled textile craftsmanship with its pleated sleeves and sewn-on yoke. The creasing at the elbows and armpits suggests that the dress was worn during the wearer's lifetime. Interestingly, the dress was discovered inside out, leading to speculation that it was intentionally placed in the tomb as a symbolic or funerary gesture. Although the dress was unearthed in 1913, its true significance was not fully understood until 1977 when conservators at the Victoria and Albert Museum in London carefully examined and displayed it. 
Archaeologists discovered the world's oldest known pair of shoes in Oregon's Fort Rock Basin in 1938. These ancient footwear, called the Fort Rock Sandals, were made from twine sage brush bark and had a flat sole with a toe wrap design. Several pairs of these sandals have been found, with the oldest estimated to be between 9,300 and 10,000 years old. Researchers believe that the sandals were fastened by wrapping the thongs around the ankle and securing them on the opposite side. The world's oldest sweater was discovered on a Norwegian glacier in 2013. Made from lamb and sheep wool in a funky diamond wool fabric, the sweater has a cool greenish-brown color and a boat neck style, tailored for a 5'9 man. This style was likely popular in Iron Age Europe and is similar to another ancient piece found in a bog over 150 years ago. The sweater shows signs of being well-loved and maintained, with evidence of being patched twice. Some researchers believe it may be one of the oldest surviving examples of upcycling, originally being a sleeveless tunic with sleeves added during the second repair. The discovery of fur linen brassieres with lace among over 2,700 textile fragments in Austria's Lemberg Castle in 2008 sheds light on undergarment history. Dating back to 1390 to 1485, these bras were called breast bags at the time. The bras have distinct cups and shoulder straps, with two of them being a mix of a bra and a short shirt, featuring eyelets for lacing. This finding provides valuable insights into historical fashion and undergarment design during the late medieval period. In 2012, archaeologists discovered the world's oldest purse in Germany. The purse was made of leather or fabric, but it has disintegrated over time. The purse was decorated with over a hundred dog teeth, ranged in a way that resembles a modern handbag flap. This suggests a level of sophistication in its design. Similar dog teeth adornments were found in hair ornaments and necklaces, indicating a fashionable trend during that time. The excavation site has also yielded various artifacts from the Stone and Bronze Ages, such as stone tools, bone buttons, and an amber necklace. Additionally, the researchers found the grave of a woman from around 50 BC, who was buried with approximately a pound of gold jewelry. The oldest snow goggles ever found date back 2,000 years to the old Bering Sea culture. These goggles were made of bone, leather, or wood. They were discovered 800 years ago on Canada's Baffin Island. The goggles were designed to protect the eyes from snow blindness caused by intense spring sunlight. The world's oldest leather shoe was discovered in Armenia's Ar Anyone Cave in 2010. The shoe is estimated to be around 5,500 years old. It is a brown leather lace-up shoe designed for a small right foot, similar to a US size 7, suggesting it was worn by a woman. The shoe was made from a single piece of leather and tanned using vegetable oil. It was carefully shaped to fit the wearer's foot. The shoe was filled with grass, possibly for insulation or to maintain its shape when not in use. I can imagine how different and interesting it must have been to use a reusable condom made from pig's intestine back in 1640 in Lund, Sweden. The instructions in Latin recommending cleaning it with warm milk to prevent the spread of sexually transmitted diseases must have been quite unique for that time period. The discovery of the skirt fragment in the Arenion cave in southeastern Armenia sheds light on ancient textile techniques. Even though only a small piece remains, it reveals that the fabric was made from woven reeds with a unique counterweave band. Unfortunately, we may never know if it was worn by a woman or a man, but this finding is still considered the oldest known example of reed clothing in the world. 
The crown, part of the Nahal Mizhar hoard, was found in a cave in the Judean desert near the Dead Sea in 1961, along with over 400 other objects, dating back to the Copper Age for 1330 BC. This unique crown is made of black and copper and is about 7 inches in diameter. The upper rim of the crown is decorated with five figures, including two long-necked birds, possibly vultures, two stylized gates or doors, and a T-shaped object resembling a sword hilt. It was discovered with a scepter featuring horned animals, a copper-woven basket, and various clay bowls and goblets. While researchers doubt that the crown belonged to an actual king in the region, they suggest it may have been used in public ceremonies and during burial rituals for important individuals. The team of archaeologists in the Republic of Georgia recently uncovered a groundbreaking find the oldest fibers ever discovered, dating back over 30 for thousand years. These fibers, thought to be from wild flax, were likely gathered from the natural surroundings rather than cultivated. Early humans displayed remarkable creativity by using these fibers to craft clothing for warmth, sewing leather pieces together with the thread. Additionally, they utilized the thread to secure packs, making it easier to transport necessities and move between different camps. Some of the fibers were twisted, suggesting that early humans used them to create ropes or strings. Furthermore, there are indications that they dyed the fibers using plants indigenous to the region. And that's a wrap, folks. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more awesome content. Ring the bell to stay updated with our latest uploads. Got any thoughts or questions? Drop me a comment below. We love hearing from you. Check out my other videos for more great content. And remember, stay curious, keep exploring, and I'll see you in the next video. Until then, take care and keep shining. Hold on a sec. I am not finished yet. Follow me on social media Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube obviously. Do it now. Come on do it. Thank you for watching. And a huge shout out to our subscribers and Patreon supporters for making this possible. You're the real MVPs. Signing off peace out.